What up, what up? Wimbush here. And today I wanted to show you guys an update in Mixer Mode. We can actually now import FBX 2019 files. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. So before I jump into Mixer Mode, if you go over to the Adobe support community, you can actually see they had a new post that went up a few days ago, actually on December 9th. It says, good news, we've upgraded the FBX XDK and Mixamo core from FBX 2014 to FBX 2019. So that means that now when we're inside of cinema and we have our character, we can actually export it at the highest FBX settings and bring that into Mixamo. And so I'm going to be using this character here. I actually got him from Jama. So if you go to his Gumroad, I'll leave it down below if you guys are interested in it. But he actually has this character here called Merbeck from his apocalyptic set, which really looks cool. And so I wanted to take this character and bring it into Mixamo just as a test, because I know if I scroll down here, it says he made it in Blender. It is optimized for Unreal, which is really cool. And so let's put it to the test and see if we could get this inside of Cinema, you know, just strip out the skeleton and everything from Blender and then bring that into Mixamo. So I have the character actually already opened up here in Cinema 4D. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the gun out because I don't need that for bring it into Mixamo and you can see we already have a skeleton in here and I believe this skeleton was built inside of Blender because that's where he built this character at and so I'm going to take this right here and I'm actually going to delete it so that's the skeletal system I'm going to take the weighting and delete it as well and then I'm just going to take the skin that's attached to all these different parts and delete all of these like so there we go and then I'm going to select all of these and actually right click come down to group because if I bring in the mannequin, I believe this character is way too large to scale. So let me see where my mannequin's at. Let me actually bring my soldier and just zero out his position. Like so. And you can see him compared to the mannequin, which is right there. He's extremely too large. So for my scale, I'm just going to bring this out to like 0.1 on each of my axes here. And then I'm just going to bring them down to about ground level until he's about the same size as my mannequin here so i'm just going to line him up just until he's about the same height touching the ground and everything so that looks pretty good there so i'm going to delete the mannequin because i don't need him as a reference and my character should be good to go to bring over to mixamo but the one thing that i noticed that mixamo doesn't like when you're bringing stuff in from cinema 40 is the reflectance channel it doesn't like those materials i know with the 2019 fbx they say that you can bring in you know other assets with it now not just the color layer but when i was doing tests earlier it actually freaked out when i did you know left the reflectance in there i'm just going to select one of these random materials here i'm going to double click on it and then you see this one has a reflectance channel, but instead of going through one by one, I can actually select all of them and then just turn off the reflectance on all the materials in my scene. So I'm just going to click and drag till I have everything selected. You can see that we have some squares in here now. So I'm going to go to reflectance, click that, and that turns it off for all of them in which I don't have to touch anything else. Everything else should come over to mix them up fine. So I'm going to exit this out and then I'm just going to take these out of the null. So everything's just kind of floating there. And so now I think my character is ready to bring over to Mixamo. So from here, I'm going to come over to file, come down to export, and then I'm going to go to FBX. I'm actually going to leave it at the top setting here. So version 7.7, .7, which is 2019. I'm just going to leave normals checked on. I don't believe it really does anything. Um, for animation, I turned off the tracks. I turned off everything over here. And then I have baked materials in here. But one thing before I export this out, I'm actually going to hit cancel because I noticed whenever I left it on track 72, it made my file size a lot larger. And that's because I think it's baking all the frames in there. So I'm actually just going to type in zero just so it's one frame here. Then I'm going to come back up to file, come down to export FBX. And again, if you need to see the settings one last time, we're on 2019. This is everything that I have check marked here. And so from here, I'm just going to click OK. And then I'm just going to find a good spot for me to save it, which I have a Mixamo test folder here. I'm going to just name this one Army, like so. And then I'm going to click Save. And that saved out pretty fast. So if I come over to my web browser, come over to Mixamo, let me go to Browse Characters. And then from here, I'm just going to come over on the right hand side where it says Upload Character. And this is where we could drag and drop the FBX into here. So I'm going to go back to my Windows Explorer and I actually have the folder already in where I need it to be. So I'm going to click on my army FBX 
click and drag that into here now this might take a few moments because if i go to my folder you can see that my file is actually 95 megabytes and so just depending on how mixamo is going to interpret this footage it could take up to a few minutes so if you do have a larger file don't worry about it you know mixamo takes some time to calculate sometimes so just let it sit tight and do its thing so now you see we have the auto rigger we have our character in here which is the fbx 2019 file so from here i'm going to click next and then we're just going to drag these into the proper spots where it needs to go so here's for the chin going to drag this over to the wrist do this for the elbows bring the knees over to about here and then the groin area and then since he has five fingers i'm just going to leave you know him with the standard skeleton use symmetry then i'm just going to click next give us a second to rig out again this is a larger file so it might take a little bit of time to calculate so i'm just going to let Mexima do its thing here and there we go inside of the auto rigger we actually have our fbx 2019 file as you can see he's moving around and everything so if i click next it's going to bring our character into mixamo here where i could come over to animation and just kind of pick a random animation here so we have him jumping off the side of a cliff they have old man idol and so this just shows you that we can now bring fbx 2019 files into mixamo and you don't have to worry i know you don't see the texture here but once you download it and then bring it back into your application the textures all come back over and so this is exactly the update that we've been waiting for so i just wanted to make you guys aware in case you didn't know that mixamo actually takes 2019 fbx files this is an upgrade that came out of nowhere and it's much appreciated and so if this helped you out make sure you leave me a comment down below if you're new to the channel make sure you click that subscribe button and until next time stay fresh keep creating and i'll catch you in the next video thank you guys again take care